some brief and unformed thoughts about Doctor Who Rogue, which I saw at midnight last night and then fell asleep quite late at night. So I'm, I'm sort of woken up a little bit sort of groggy from the whole thing. A lot of people, I've seen some videos about it and a lot of people have pointed out the, the music that is, uh, well, it's modern music. You've got Billie Eilish, bad guy. You've got Lady Gaga, poker face. And you've also got Can't Get You Out My Head by Kylie Minogue, who, if you'll remember, was in The Voyage of the Titanic. Is that what it was called? Astrid, Astrid Peth. So that made me think of Astrid. Also, I've said before, the guest stars. The guest stars are very obviously guest stars. You've got Jonathan Groff. Jonathan Groff? Jonathan Groff, sorry. Who was famously King George III, who would still be just about, just about alive at the time that this episode was set, which was 1813. Was he? Yes, because... Yes, he was still just about hanging on by a thread. I think he died 1814. I'd have to check that. I'm not a history vlogger, so don't take my word for it. But I'm thinking that this is another another example of the whole thing. With this is slightly off kilter, the whole thing and the the whole body swapping thing. Yeah, that's. Uh, I was also thinking of uh, obviously a lot of people have said the Slitheens with the whole, the family that are doing stuff. And also, family of blood, remember that. The same sort of, this is, so there's something spooky going on, a little bit weird. Uh, obviously, Ruby Sunday was like magically able to overcome adversity and also saved in the nick of time the whole thing. This is a spoiler, by the way. If you've seen it, I'm sorry, I've spoiled it. But also, the Doctor's Faces, where you all, you had Richard E. Grant, Scream of the Schalke, which was, canonical at the turn of the millennium when they made it which is an animated one which also had um it had the master in it as a robot a robot master played by somebody Derek Derek Jacobi Derek Jacobi who also went on to play the master slightly later so that and it was canonical until they started making the series and then nine got replaced obviously Christopher Eccleston replaced replaced nine and nine was forgotten from history even though it was canon at the time and it was always said to be canon mm -mm -mm -mm. and also you've got uh, also the war doctor all the doctors all the doctor's faces but you also had the roof doctor i think it was the roof doctor it was difficult to tell because all the faces blended into one it might have been a completely different doctor because i know that uh there's quite a lot of radio big finish doctors that uh were they can were they canonical or not and, and and there's also been debate about whether the children in need special with Rowan Atkinson. They didn't have Rowan Atkinson. Now the whole point is this is this is fuel for the fire that this is all a bit because if you've got Kylie Minogue playing and you're thinking Kylie Minogue, this is a modernish song with Kylie Minogue who was in Doctor Who. You've got somebody that famously played George the Third in it as not George the Third, and everyone's thinking about Captain Jack when he's not Captain Jack, so you know, the whole thing. And it's not the first kiss, because obviously Captain Jack smacked, not smacked, but <laughs> planted a kiss on, on the Doctor, and it's, it's, uh, it's happened before, it's not the first time it's happened, although some people are like, oh! but it was scandalous, it's scandalo. Um, so uh, <laughs> it wasn't scandalous, it was, but it, was, it would have been scandalous at the time. So they played on that. So the whole thing, and they, they've also mentioned Strictly Come Dancing in the episode. Ah, oh, this is just like Strictly. And they had actual actors playing themselves in the Beatles episode actual Strictly Come Dancing people playing themselves in a 1960s episode which is uh, so the history's gone wild this is all non-diogenic diogenetic genetic yes it's diogenetic diogen you know what I mean Dio non-diogetic and it's it's all digestible and genetic at the same time yeah yeah my mouth is going away I'm just saying this these are just ideas. Obviously, these are unformed and a little bit off kilter, which is what I think you'll find. I said it was going to be brief. It's not brief, but I think you'll find that it's all off kilter and there's something spooky going on. Obviously, we saw the Susan twist twist with the painting. So she's not there, but she was there. 
They just miss twist. They just miss the twist. And also, I was thinking as Rogue went away and said, find me, that uh, you'll be back. He'll be back. <laughs> so um, that's another layer of the possible. This is peculiar. 